Strolling and bonding, that's the idea of the Memphis Zoo Stroll. Visual storyteller Sheila Whaley figured out how it all works. We're gonna go right in here. What we love about Zoo Stroll is that we get to get here before the zoo is open, have the place to ourselves. We can come earlier in the morning before it gets too hot. Zoo Stroll is a program where parents can come in with their toddlers in strollers and we get to stroll around the zoo before the zoo opens. So it starts at 8 a.m. and then ends at 9. We get to learn all these fascinating things that when just coming to the zoo normally, we wouldn't just outright know. They're cold-blooded. So we get someone that explains all these cool things about the animals. See if we can get a tortoise to come over. Today our zoo stroll letter was R for reptile. I was like, he is just moving around all for y'all. I think that the big one is like in his 60s at least. They get this one-on-one -on -one, um, experience with, um, with someone from the zoo and the animals. He's getting his exercise just like we are. And the kids love it. Isn't that neat? We get to meet animals one-on-one. -on -one. The kids seem to love it. <laughs> I always give them times to get up and get out of their strollers and kind of run around and be kids. And we can do that, especially because the zoo's not open. I get to meet other moms, which is so, so helpful as a new mom to get make friends. I heard you saw a really big lizard. Do you remember what the big lizard was called? Another good thing that they get to do is they also get to see an ambassador animal from one of our interpreters um, here at the zoo. He's never gonna grow to those great big sizes. We have a whole animal collection that is trained to meet people. And so they get to see them one-on-one, -on -one, get that interaction with them. Being able to interact with a zookeeper. Our kids really enjoy that. I'm gonna give it a go. Right on that shelf, very nice. You probably could see from Jackson's jumping around that he was very, very into it. I would tell those parents that know nothing about zoo strolls that they should experience it. Definitely wanna do it again. <laughs> Well, the event isn't just for kids. If you know someone in a wheelchair, they're welcome too. Unfortunately, today was the last zoo stroll of the season, but no worries, they'll start it back up again in August. Check it out then.